Lucky Devil. <laughs> So good. I've got a clean visual. A direct feed to your optic nerve. <laughs> yes, I should hope so, huh? I mean, how does it feel? To fly like a bird. Like a bird strapped to a remote control rocket. <laughs> we will get you in safely, Tovarich. Just relax and enjoy the ride. Right. Can you hear me, Raikou? Doctor. Remember the two procedures to maintain your new body. One, seizing nano repair units from your foes. And two, absorbing their electrolytes. I got it. Yes, enemy sidewalks should provide plenty of MCFC electrolytes once you slice them open and uh, extract their fluids. They're terrorists. I was planning on that anyway. Oh, and their left hands, if you please. Excuse me? Is a combat data stored on holographic memory, typically located in the left hand. That data is very valuable. <clears throat> I am authorized to offer you upgrades and services in exchange for it. How generous. Ich liebe Kapitalismus. Had the world come down a few years earlier, I would have a Nobel Prize on my shelf. There, I see land. Three miles out, closing. No activity at the airbase. Looks like we don't need to worry about interceptors. Great. Then we have time for a quick briefing. I know you miss me, Kev, but I've been all over the materials. <laughs> That's what you said before Montenegro. Look, just humor me, buddy. Objectives, of course, are enter Abkhazia, neutralize the terrorists, and restore the rightful government, or what's left of it anyway. The president and most of the cabinet have been killed, and a military junta has been established. The terrorists brain-jacked all the high-ranking officers, and their cyborgs scattered the rank and file. The few leaders who have survived have no way of openly opposing the new regime. That's what they called us. Andrei Dolsayev, leader of the occupation forces, an extremist linked to both the St. Petersburg massacre of 2015 and last year's terror spree in Georgia. And his arms supplier, none other than Desperado Enforcement LLC. Imani's killers. If we don't stop them here, they could destabilize the entire region. But our more immediate problem is Jetstream Sand. I believe you've met. <sighs> Imani. 
only problem I see is that nickname. I've got my enhancements this time. He won't be an issue. He may not even be in country, but keep an eye out, Justin. No. Oh. Uh, sorry. Ready for insertion. Raiden, you landed safely, duh? First, head inland. The waypoint is marked on your Solitan radar. Contact us on Kodak if you have questions. So this is the level from the demo. And um, I will probably not be doing a lot of S ranking because I'm not terribly great at combos and whatnot. And here's the cat. Um, so they've actually... In implemented quite a few good things back from the uh, original Metal Gears to this game. One of the fun things is the actual codec is back and they actually have a lot of uh, interesting facts and stories. I'll probably go through... Control, it's Raiden. I'm on the ground. Copy Raiden. Glad to hear it. Entering on foot was the right move. That craft isn't equipped with stealth camo. Or Octocamo, obviously, since that would be useless in midair. And we wouldn't want to get your pricey new jet damaged, now would we? Duh. The MQ-133C was not cheap to manage. <laughs> now, keep alert. According to Intel, you could find significant cyborg deployment here. If you were to be cornered by an entire squad, it might get... difficult, even for you. Understood. Some fighting will be necessary, though. I've got electrolytes to replenish. Hmm. This is not an infiltration mission. There is no need to hide or avoid combat outright, huh? Just do not get reckless. Stay safe and stay focused on your mission. So yeah, you can talk on the codec. The thing about the left hands is those are pretty much the dog tags of this game. You collect the left hands, you get specials and whatnot, you know, cool things. Bastards are using stealth camo to ambush you. Nice try, but it won't do any good against a state-of-the-art cyborg like you. Very good, very incoming team. Throw out your own barrage of light attacks while your foe is on the offensive. You'll also be seeing a lot of that um, now. Um, this is the gameplay. Because you get a um, hundred BP every time you do it, so had your fill with this body. I could take these guys with no eyes. Intel wasn't exaggerating on the cyborg count. Well, you know how fast the tech's been spreading these last few years. That CNT muscle fiber packs the power of a jackhammer into every limb. What enterprising soldier of fortune could resist? And cyborgs are still human. Real thinking people. Way less risk of collateral damage than your typical UAV strike. And don't forget the PR angle. Nations start playing Frankenstein with their troops, and the public goes nuts. PMCs, on the other hand, are off the ethical radar. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They still don't even count PMCs in official death tolls. With SOP out of the picture, private militaries needed a new edge on the market. We got it. I know 
a way, cyborgs are just SOP troops by another name. Only all muscled up and less predictable. But it makes you wonder, where'd Desperado find these guys? I'm not complaining. They're like walking vending machines. Right. Vending machines full of blood. <sighs> Easy there, Dracula. Like I said, they're still people. People who terrorize and take innocent lives for money. They sowed their fate when they took this job. I'm just the Reaper. Damn. It's a bit cold, Raiden. Even for you. Anyway, uh, his school. Let's get to work. Time to increase the peace. Right. And I will also be trying to get all the items and bonus items and whatnot. Right. Um, you need to head inland. I haven't located all the VR missions, but I have located most of them. So. Ryder, this is Boris. Give me your status. Looks clear. No one in sight. Good. Let's recap the route you will take. As I said. The enemy's HQ is in the refinery along the coastline. Dolsayev has been spotted there using satellite photography. Also on site, Mistral, a desperado captain. So I go through the city, cross the bridge into the old town, then head down to the rear of the refinery. Still, I think they anticipate us. They will probably have a grand reception awaiting you at the old city. Do not let your guard down. Yeah, um... I will try my best to find all the bonus items. But I can't promise it. Uh, I have... I do know where a lot of the... The, uh... What's it called? The VR mission boxes are. Which you'll find in a very short amount. But, um, so, and I'll be doing those in another video. Hostiles in the lower corridor, I see. Try to flank them, or approach from behind. Or videos, I should say. There's like 20-something. A good amount for, um, a game. <laughs> Excellent, Raiden. Raiden, take that main thoroughfare. You can use augment mode to see where the enemy is located. Your body analyzes radar and IR data to construct your AR display. Huh. Some civilians are still in the city. That is not good. Yeah. So, in this uh, actual first set, uh, I might actually only going to beat these first two levels only because I my pre-order code for Grey Fox is not ready yet and I do want to see how that skin uh, plays in this game so you can actually use your these items um, off this screen by hitting square and if you hit um, down on the d-pad so careful for watching out for that now there's a civvy over here, so we're just gonna blow these guys up. What are you doing here? This area is off limits. What? No, I'm not doing anything. So it's always good to 